Where are we going, Avery? We're going to the shop, and then when we're at the shop, we're going to set up, and then we're going to tell you all about the shop. Let's get it on. We are now heading to the shop. Avery's crying on us. Yeah, she's crying because we're leaving. And it's a cold day here in New Jersey. So Billy is going to videotape us on our ride to the shop. Yes, it was 29 degrees this morning down in New Jersey. So it must be snowing in New York and it's freezing. Probably. 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 We are now riding over to the shop. And it only takes one minute to the shop. As you can see, if you can see, all the way back there, the shop's all the way back there. It takes like five minutes to walk there, but it takes one minute to drive. So now we're in the car. And peace out. We are now arriving to the shop. Boop, boop. We now arrived to the shop. Yeah, so now we're gonna go enter into the shop here and see what was done. We've all been kind of working at different times, um, so we don't really know what was done today. So now we're gonna turn the light on and see what we got. Yes, we are now at the shop. Let me show. Okay. It's still recording. All right, so I have, it is the winter time and during the day today, Art visited the shop and did some wiring. So anybody knows, it's like looking at chicken wires. So look at all the wires that come with these gauges today. It's a, yeah, it's like a wiring paradise. There's a lot of stuff we do, but uh, I give him credit for having the patience because that is definitely above and beyond what I know how to do, or I can do, so. But the rest, we're good to go. We are getting there. Ooh. So yeah, so I walk in, I go, okay, what do I do next? And me and Billy are gonna try to figure out what we're gonna do next here at the shop, so. Yep. We might pop you up. Billy's gonna take you for a walk around here, show you what's up, and then uh, we'll pop you in and maybe do some videotaping. I'm now six. So. I'm on my go-kart roof, as you can see. So, we're packaging up some things, and we're gonna do lots of shows today at the shop. So we are unloading parts here at the shop, and I'm gonna make a huge box and cut it down. And these pick arms can fit into it to ship. And the first problem already is they don't fit. So uh, I guess this box ain't gonna work. Let's find out if it works. Let's go find out if it works. So how do you think it's gonna work? I don't think it's gonna work. Look at the box. I think we're in trouble here. Um, no, we are still recording. Yeah, I know. So, yeah, that's not gonna fit. <laughs> I don't. Finding a box. So it's good to sell used parts, but it's terrible go, to find a box. I'll go find. I'll go find something. I'll go find something. Now, so, found the box. Yeah, it would work. Yeah. My six-year-old <laughs> finds the box that I can't find in the shop. So let's try to make. These fit in there. Magic. So that goes to right here. Yeah, I can't even work right here, guys. So we're gonna cut it down to a valve right here. Yeah, the razor blade that's uh, not the sharpest. This is easy to put your hand. So maybe get a different, a different razor blade. Um, I'm gonna try to make this one work because I got this part. So now, the fun part. Fee, 25 bucks. I don't know what this box is off of, but it's off of something. So now let's see if we can make this box work, ladies and gentlemen. Let's cut down. It might not be pretty, but we're gonna get these pick arms out today. Now we just need some packaging paper. Let's go rate it. Come on, Billy. Here we go. Trying to get them. 
as you can see it, we're walking through the shop. And the trucker is still here from the last video or the one before. I hope we find the packaging tape. I, am I really paper. hope so. I'm digging a paper for us to package this uh, quick arms up here, as you can see. So we'll, uh, we'll get them shipped up and uh, ready to go. We're going to follow along a little bit. This is not the best setup, so we had to walk up a little bit through the welding shop to get to the paper. And now we're going to head back and finish packaging this box up. You walk fast. I can't keep up with you. Get your pace going, right guys? Tell BB3 it's time to hustle and ain't time to sit around. I think everybody knows me around this year. We think we got it, guys. And that, my friend, is how you get pick arms in a box. That was our project for the day. I, now, we got the packaging in there. Now we just need packaging tape to find out. So what do you do when you're in doubt? He's behind that car. Now we can't see you back there. Well, I'm coming back. When you ain't got packaging tape, see. you use good old ISC racer tape. Proud sponsor, Pouch Racing. Welcome to the team. So we're gonna use some blue racer tape. The UPS man loves Billy Pouch when I uh, drop packages off because I always duct tape everything. Because that's what I have. If that's what you got, you make it work. So we're getting ready for this. And then we are continuing to work in the shop here for a little bit. Gonna do some more work and see what happens. Say that again. I'm officially a country music person when it gets towards uh, this time of the year. We like to rock out on some country and see what happens. We are not only shipping out, we're receiving. It's like Christmas when Bilstein sends us shocks. Gotta love Bilstein shock absorbers coming at you on each corner. And if you saw that show three years ago, where Billy Pat Jr. turned yep. when? Well, on my birthday. Three years ago. Three years ago. I don't even know what I turned, 30, 31? 30 or 31, three years ago. And if you watch that show, where Bill Team Chuck came to that day at New Egypt, that trailer, that's their shocks. We use their shocks. So, so it's good we, they give us there, because so as we walk by the shop, you always put up a little motivation. Just something I learned from Ray Abraham years ago. Races are one in the shop. That's the key to it. So the more time you spend in the shop, the better off you are. Um, Billy wants to go through a stats that I think Skyler wrote, but Billy originally wrote. We had 72 starts, 17 wins, 35 top fives, 52 top tens. Time to kick off 2022 at, well, we forgot to put on Allentown next weekend. Then we go to Allentown, then we go to Alltech. Cherokee and Georgetown. So it's coming, ladies and gentlemen. Before you know it, we'll be back at it. This is what happens when your six-year-old leaves his coat in the center of your race car. So what's cool, as we keep going through the package today and getting a little insight on what we're going on, we, uh, we are impressed by Arts Radiator's quality. They give me everything to put in this brand new radiator in a little package. So that's the difference between nowadays. People don't have time to chase everything. So shout out to Arts for giving me the fittings. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with them. Come here. So over here, you can see we got this. We got sensors, so Billy videotapes the radiator. We're gonna put this fitting in here. Boom. And then. As you can see, this hole is where we put them in. Yep, we're gonna put a top one in if you wanna show the top one. Then we have a top one right there. Okay. Then we have two bottoms right there. Yeah. And no, boom. Boom, look at that, into the yeah. radiator. And we only have that one. So we're not doing too bad. We're just gonna put these in here for now. Look at this, boom. 
Top service on top parts. Check out ours. See, Billy Pass Jr. has got a lot of tricks. And if you come over here, you can see Billy Pass Jr. tricks, which is a lot of old school tricks. Boom. Boom. Check luck. There's our tricks. We want to get more tricks. So, so, we want to get some more tricks. So, we have this thing here, which I got for my birthday. I'm sick now. My birthday is December 21st. 23rd. No, 31st. I'm going to show you what's around this. Around the go-kart. Around this. What, this motor carrier. Peace out. Now we're going to show you. The rod of this thing I just taught you. Here we go. And he rolls, and he rolls, and ladies and gentlemen, he rolls some more. Activate. Alright guys. We got some cool pieces in from McNell Racing Products today. As always, it's like Christmas when McNell comes around. Putting some cover ups on our uh, torsion racks. If we want to run some coils here and there and see what happens, you know? So, we're going to take the tape off of this because I've mutilated this thing and uh, organize up a little bit. Here comes Speedy. Speedy's back. Putting our packages away, right Billy? Yeah. Just now, we have this dog, Speedy. I forgot, you've seen Speedy before. <laughs> Billy Pouch with the MPI steering wheel. Let's steer, let's see what you got. <laughs> Well, there he goes, ladies and gentlemen. He is off on the Easy Roller Express. <laughs>